All right, guys, <clears throat> this is going to be the first of a new series of uh, videos that I'm going to be doing. It's going to be called Loadout, and it's pretty much going to be giving you the rundown of how I have my current rifle set up on whatever the, the video is, whatever the rifle is, it's going to go through um, the setup of that particular gun. So I've been, I've been mainly collecting rifles. Well, first of all, the purpose there of me, my collections, my, my, my main interest in the collection is um, modern military style rifles. So that's my motivation, my initial motivation. motivation. And from there, um, I'm, once I get a rifle that I'm interested in, that, I, that fits roughly around that criteria, I go ahead and I purchase certain things that, I, that interest me or that I like that's on the market um, that makes that rifle either more um, efficient or, or you know works best for me or might just be some tactical stuff that's out that's with the current trends whatever it is um, so that what that's what motivates me and how I set up my guns and what rifles I buy so in saying that we're gonna go over <clears throat> this particular gun um, don't mind the leaves since fall so there's gonna be leaves falling all throughout the video um, like that one and this particular gun is a, a build this just started um, started from a engaged armament um, E4 lower and upper these are billet, billet pieces I had it seracoded by Sterling Arsenal um, I got the Centurion Arms uh, CMR handguard this is actually the uh, this is the uh, 14 inch version it's on the 16 inch barrel um, we have next up front we have an AAC um, breakout uh, I'm sorry this is a, this is the um, a blackout break Arasaka defense uh, one inch flashlight mount here with a old Surefire 660 that's attached to an SRO7 Surefire switch. Have a Magpul and Bust Gen 2 at the front sight. All the CMR attachments for the uh, rail. Um, American Defense 30 millimeter, uh, I guess it's offset uh, scope, scope mount. One piece scope mount, quick, quick detach. Burst intact scope, uh, one to four. <clears throat> Mount knighted, bow carry group, tangle down, pistol grip, Magpul ACSL stock, BCM gunfighter charging handle. Uh, this one also has a, um, a uh, trigger. Forget the uh, name of the trigger right off the top of my head, but it's a very nice trigger. Shoots really fast, as you can see in the video. I think the weight is about four and a half pounds. I actually did a video on this, so I'll put a link in the description box for the trigger and a link in the description box for the original build for this gun if you want to get more information. This gun is on a voodoo barrel, uh, one and seven twists, government profile barrel. That's mid-length, mid-length uh, gas gas system on there. What else is on here? And that pretty much sums up the gun. So pretty, this gun is going to be in this configuration probably forever. I've moved on from this gun in the setup, so I'm not really focused on this gun. Um, as I'm saying, I'm trying to complete all the guns I have in my collection. And as I complete them, as as I get to them to a finished state, I'll put out another one of these loadout videos with the uh, particular gun in the, in the um, as part of the uh, title. So hope you appreciate these videos. Um, hope to put some more out soon. Um, thanks for watching.